welcome back everyone. So, so now, so the first step for you to do is, so, so like, from here, right, I said click on file, new project, so that's what we're going to do right now. So, let's click on file, new, and you click on project. So, and I said, search for the template that we're going to use. So you click on test, and we're going to use MS test project. MS test test project dot net core. That's what we're going to use. Then after you click on it, you click on next. So then you put the name of, or you type the name of the project that you want, let's say blue sky. Test framework one. Okay, test framework one. So I can s select where I want it to be. Okay, I want in that location. Then I can decide to say, okay, I want to place my solution and project in the same folder. So you can give that edge and see what its difference is. Or you can as well say, okay, I want my solution to be in this particular folder. Or you want, you can actually change the folder name, basically. But depending on what you want, that is not an issue, to be honest. So, and even if you put your name like that, it's, it's the same thing, anyway. So, you, and then you can click on create. Okay, so now you have this particular window, so I'm going to extend this basically to see what you have. So now you have this window, and you have this window also. So this window, by default, you might have two tabs, Solution Explorer and Team Explorer. In your Solution Explorer, that's where you have your files, and I said, what you need to do, you delete this particular file because we don't need, need it as a unit test um, class and unit test is normally done by um, developers as I mentioned in the last class. So that's why we don't need this particular uh, file uh, or if we want to be technical, we don't need that class again. So I will delete that particular file. So that is gone now so and the next step now is for me to update my step update my file so that is done 